Good morning. Today is December 9th. I have a slight, slight cold. We are taking care of it because I need to be functioning. So just pray for my cold, please, um, that it goes away and it never returns. That's what we need. It's just awesome prayer. If everybody prays, guess what? It happens. Um, and so I'm reading from a different devotional today. Today is um, 365 days of prayers for women. Again, if you read a woman's book, you can be a man because it pertains to you too. It's just because it says prayers for women. It got flowers on it. That's why it says prayers for women, right? Um, so it can be, this is a very good one. And I was like, ooh, people need to hear this, right? It's about hypocrisy, right? And here we go. It says, you hypocrite. First, take the wood out of your own eye. Then you will see clearly to take the dust out of your friend's eye. That's Matthew 7, 5. If you don't know that verse, please read it. Lord, next time, the next time I start pointing fingers, please hold up a mirror. The moment I start making suggestions for ways people could improve, illuminate my flaws. And please forgive my hypocrisy. Lord, until my own vision is clear, keep my fingers away from the eyes of my friends. I know I've brought this before you before, God, and I will explain it, and I will expect it, and I expect I will again. It is a clever trap and easy to fall into once I realize I am in it. I des desperately want out. Don't let me be that person, Lord, who has everyone else so figured out I'm driving them all away. Make me transparent and forgiving, non-judgmental and deceived. If there is sin to be identified, let it be my own. Have you taken the wood out of your own eye instead of inspecting those around you? Ooh, this is good lordy, 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 right? This is some good stuff. Okay. We all do this. I am guilty of it too, right? And we all are judging other people right? Can't say you haven't because we all have. And you know, the thing is, is that we should not judge because God judges us, right? And there is so much of my past, like tons and tons of stuff from my past. People all the time on here, like bring it up. Oh, you did this. So you did that. You know what I mean? Like no sin is greater than another sin. You know that, right? So you're bringing up my past. God forgave me in my past. Has he has he forgiven you of your past? You know what I mean? Have you brought that sin to God and asked for forgiveness? And what right does a person have to judge another person? You are not walking in that person's shoes. You don't know that person. So how can you judge them? How can you judge? Because when we all pass away and die, right? Who judges us? Not that, not the other person that's been like judging you for your whole life, right? No, it's God that judges us. And like, oh, you did this. You don't get to go there, right? Because you have to be good and you have to be kind. And you have to love, 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 love. Like that's the thing you have to love. And, you know, over the years, I had to learn to love people that just ain't right. They just ain't right. But God will take care of that. You know what I mean? You have to have faith that God will take care of that because God God can change anybody he changed me he changed you he changes anybody right but the thing is is that we have to love those people who are not changed yet who are looking at us like oh we're better because we're Christian no we're not I'm a servant I'm not better than anybody at all I am not and I love everybody and just because I'm on here talking to you about Jesus and God and everything like that doesn't mean I'm better than you at all. Nope, does not. This is what God has put in my heart to tell you about, you know, about him, about Jesus and God, you know. And, and I have such a great platform that I can do this. You know, God is using me. And that's what I feel in my heart. And this is why I'm talking about it. And I'm not a Jesus scholar. I am not a theologist. I'm just doing what the Holy Spirit leads me to do. And if I'm wrong on something, please correct me. You know, 
I, I'm just doing what the Holy Spirit leads me to do, what I feel, and that's it, you know? But I know we shouldn't judge others. So that's the right answer, right? And like I said, I'm guilty of it too. So let's try to love everybody today. Everybody you come in contact with, even if it's somebody, somebody that is not cool with you, you know, because I don't use the H word, like, you know, hate, that's a bad word, right? That's just strong. You shouldn't use that. It's just negative energy. But love everybody because I love you. Have a blessed and wonderful day.